Hi guys, today we are going to talk about how to use the Genesis user profile widget. So I want to show you, we're going to drag the Genesis user profile widget into a sidebar and I'm just going to title this. Hi there. And what you do is you choose the user here. I'm going to choose site gorilla fun, which is me. And then we're going to leave all this alone. Um, I am going to choose to leave my author bio and I want to link it to my about page. I'm going to hit save. I will show you what it looks like. So there you go. Hi there. And if I go to read more, it's going to dump me right back on this page because this is my about page, but I'm just showing you. So, uh, it's going to be a problem to get an image in there because what we need to do is go into users and site gorilla fun is the user I chose. But as you can see, it makes you choose a gravatar. If your email doesn't have a gravatar, it's this whole big thing to set up. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into plugins, user profile image. I'm going to copy that and then I'm going to go hit add new and I'm just going to paste that into the look. So what we want to do is get one that is updated recently and looks pretty simple. User profile picture updated seven days ago. That looks good. We're going to install Activate. And now we're going to go to users. And now we should be able to upload a photo. So there we go. Go click to edit. I'm just going to choose this as my user photo. Set profile. And update. And now we're going to go back here. And I'll show you the photo. There we go, it's updated the photo. I'm gonna add a little bit of text in as well. I'm just gonna go to my user profile and I'm gonna go, hi, I'm Steph. I make websites for a living need a new website call me and i believe this will take html let's just try it out a href equals Copy this and hit TEL colon plus one, that's the United States, and then just paste the rest of the phone number in. Oops, forgot the two. And let's see how that does. We'll update the profile and come back here. And there you go. I'm probably going to put that on another line, but this is default how it comes. In another video, I'll show you how to make this profile image larger and how to add correct spacing in here if it doesn't come out well on your theme. Hope you enjoyed. Hit that like button if this helped you. Subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notifications button to get these videos to your inbox as I upload them. And remember, don't let your website drive you bananas.